When you come into the NICU, sometimes it's hard to find your baby amidst all the various machines and technologies that are help supporting your baby's very life. Parents frequently have difficulty even focusing in on their baby during their very first visit. What you may notice first is something called a warmer bed. Sometimes it has a plastic top over it. And that's designed to allow your baby to stay warm. There is a heat source there so that your baby who is very, very small, maybe as much as five or 600 grams, doesn't have to spend additional calories to try and maintain their body heat when we can do that for them. You may see various equipment that helps support the baby's breathing. This can include everything from a ventilator to some oxygen, to a cannula that's in their nose and helps them to breathe, to the specialty thing that we use an awful lot, CPAP, that allows a little bit of pressure to be exerted to help the baby's lungs stay inflated. In addition, you're gonna see lots of monitoring equipment, things that monitor the baby's heart rate, respiratory rate, blood pressure, oxygen level, and they are hooked to the babies by different leads or little patches and allow us to continuously assess your baby's status. When you finally can get your eyes in and really see the baby well, lots of times the first things you'll notice are the various tubes that we've placed. The baby will have a tube usually in the mouth that is called an endotracheal tube, and that tube hooks the baby's lungs to the ventilator, allowing the ventilator to support their breathing. In addition, there'll be a small tube usually in the mouth or nose that goes down into the stomach, and allows us to pull out any additional air the baby may have swallowed and to be there later for when we do feedings. You may see an IV and an IV in the skin. And in babies, what's really different than adults, you may see it in their feet, you may see it along their scalp. We use different of those veins because they're so small. But by far the biggest IV that you'll see is in the baby's belly button. Nature really helps us out a lot. And in the belly button, there are three large vessels, two arteries and one vein. And for many days, we will have what's called a catheter in there that we can use to draw blood and to give the baby fluids so as not to use all those little small peripheral veins. You may also see some bright sort of purplish colored lights. That's phototherapy. We use that to help bring a baby's bilirubin or level of jaundice down to normal. Baby may have eye patches on to protect their eyes while they're there. But all of this equipment is just part of the care of your infant. What I always encourage parents to do is to try and track the equipment down to their baby. Get your eyes focused on that baby. Put your hand over their face. Get them to get their little eyes open in that bright light. Connect with them at that level. As mom and dad, your number one job is connecting to your baby. Don't let all of that equipment that we're sort of responsible for distract you from your very important job.